recording in progress. All right, fantastic. Good morning, good afternoon, everybody. So glad to have you here. Uh, I'm Dr. Roz, and I want to share some powerful information. If this is your very first time being in this training and in this learning about who we are at Wakana and how for you to be blessed and how for you to grow and benefit, then I'm glad to have you here. One of the things that I start off with is letting you know something I learned from my mentor many, many years ago. And that was that the way up is to help another man up. It's, it seems like it ought to make sense because if you help somebody else up, that means you're up there too, right? Okay, so one of the beautiful things about Wakana is that what, that's what we're all about. Again, my name is Dr. Roz. My full name is Dr. Roslyn Shaw Belt. I am the CEO of Dream to Life Productions and Ministry. I'm a wife. I am a musician. I am a videographer. I love to do that. And many years ago, I was president of a record company for many years, and I learned how to become a recording engineer. So I'm able to do that as well. I, I do a little bit of web and graphic designing. Uh, as I said, I have two doctorates, one's in theology, one's in divinity. Uh, for many years, I was co-pastor of a church where I worked in a ministry for about 29 years and learned everything related to ministry and was ordained there. Uh, since that time, independently, I'm an inspirational and motivational speaker. Love to do that more than I think anything I love to teach. And I am a licensed insurance agent in two states, uh, Texas and in Georgia. And I'm a network marketer. And you'll learn more about that. And I'm so blessed and privileged to be an MRO here at Wakana. Now, as it relates to an industry, when it comes to network marketing, a lot of people get a bad taste in their mouth when they mention that word, network marketing, MLMs, direct selling. Because people say, well, I don't like to sell. Well, I'm so glad you don't like to sell because we don't need salesmen. We need people that have hearts. But we want you to, be, to understand that there are some things that are important whenever you make a decision. Now, you made a decision, if you're here this morning, to be a part of Wakana. Wakana encompasses all of it. But you need to know what's really important for your business to be successful. A lot of times we think it's the products. Now, definitely you gotta have good products. You definitely wanna have a good compensation plan that you can make some money. You want the company to be not a fly by night, but something that's very stable. And you want it to be the timing of a good opportunity. And even important is that you want to have a good sponsor. Although often people are successful in businesses that don't have any of these things because they find themselves doing something that works for everybody. Now, when I think about football, baseball, basketball, I'm a sports fan. Yes, we're watching the playoffs right now, watching the finals, teams that are getting into the finals. But there's something about certain teams that seem to get there every year. See, these are some teams, and they might not be in your city or in your state, but these are teams in each of those uh, sports, football, basketball, and baseball, they have the records for the most number of championships. Some kind of way they get there. And even though each year they lose players, players get hurt, players retire, but they still find a way to win. How is that possible? Well, there's something they all have in common. The same way it is when you go across town to KFC on one side of town, and go to KFC on the other side of town. And no matter which side of town you go on, you still have the same number of herbs and spices. Starbucks, they still put the number, same number of squirts to make your cappuccino or your frappuccino. And it has nothing to do with the person. It has nothing to do with their skill set or their education or how tall or short or how good they are. McDonald's fries taste the same everywhere. And Chick-fil-A has got the pattern down. I don't care how long the line is, they've got some way to get you through the line. It's called a system and it's duplicatable. What do I mean by that? That means anybody can do it if they learn the system. It has nothing to do with how educated you are. And people often come to a con and say, well, I don't talk as good as this one, or I can't do a presentation like that, or I'm shy, or I'm this, or I'm that, all kinds of excuses. But here, I'm going to eradicate all of your excuses this morning. If you can tap into our system, it is duplicatable. And that's what I'm gonna show you. There are 10 points 
to our duplicatable system. It's called the Sales Academy Training. Number one, what is your why? Why are you here? Why are you sitting here watching this, whether you're watching it live or by video on a Saturday or whenever, whatever time you're watching, why? Why did you say yes to Wakanda? Why did you join? Why? It's been taught to us that if your why doesn't make you cry, it's not big enough. What do I mean by that? Why? Because every day is not going to be Sunday. Every day, everybody's not going to be in favor of what you do. Everybody's not going to join your business. Everybody's not going to try your product. So your why has to be huge because on those days, you've got to still keep on trucking, baby. I'm going to show you. My why starts off being my husband. I want to retire him. And we are getting so much closer to that retirement day. And then we want to travel. We love to travel. We love the water. We love those all-inclusive resorts where everything is taken care of. And then because I am a music person, matter of fact, I'm a musician myself. I love music. My husband loves music. We're building our own studio. I told you I'm a recording engineer. We're building our own studio in our home, working on that, building state of the art. And then we want to own our own supper club. So when you come to Houston, you're going to be able to go to our supper club and have good quality down-home cooking. Might be vegan, might not. Okay, I'm just saying. But good live, enemy, live music, live jazz, live gospel, live R&B, spoken word. That's my why. And then it goes another step further because I know that I was designed and ordained by God to be a blessing. We were created for that purpose. So I really want to be able to give to whoever I want to, what I want to, when I want to. Number two, write down your goals. See, when you came to Wakanda, you had some goals. You had some reasons that you're here. What are those goals? They may be here in your head, but you need to write them down. Scripture says, write the vision and make it plain. So what do you want to accomplish? The who, the what, the where, the when, the why. It needs to be very, very specific because if it's not specific, you might end up anywhere. And then you need to measure those goals because oftentimes you are accomplishing something and you don't even recognize it. How many of you ever wrote down a goal, put it in a drawer, came back a year later and found out, my God, I did that. So we want to measure your progress. Give yourself a hand clap. Pat yourself on the back just for showing up today. You have, in, you have accomplished a goal. And then you want to make sure that that goal is attainable. Now, a lot of times we say, okay, I, I want to make $100,000 in one week. Okay, is that really attainable? Now, there's no limit. Don't misunderstand me. There's no limit to what you can do here at Wakana. But let's think about you, who you are. Let's think about what your atmosphere is like. Let's think about what else is on your plate. That's when you determine whether something's attainable or not. Because if you say you want to do that, hey, we're all in it with you. But just know, you're going to talk with Connor 24-7. You you're not going to really have time for family, for friends, for hubby, for wife, you know, a job. You're going to be with Connor 365, 24 hours a day. And then it has to matter to you. And I often say this, and I'm trying to get better and better at it. And when I think I got it, I found out I don't, because I really want things better sometimes for people than they want for themselves. See, that goal has to matter to you. And like I said earlier, it has to relate to your life. Because when you came to Wakanda, you brought some things with you, family, a job. Maybe you already have a business. You already have some things that are priority in your life. And so it has to be an alignment with what's already in your life, because what we want you to do, soon as you get here, within the first 30 days, is to set some target dates. Yeah, you need three dates. We need to know when are you going to have a grand opening. You say a grand opening, what is that? Who has a business and doesn't let everybody know you're open? Did you realize that you are now the owner of your own online dispensary? Yes, you own just like a CBD Amazon, health and wellness Amazon now. And we need to have a grand opening where you tell everybody, and I'll tell you in a minute why I say everybody. You're going to tell everybody that you are open for business, that they can come to your store and shop. We call it a lunch party, a grand opening. Sometimes you can even join with our corporate lunch party and have your grand opening. But we want you to let everybody know. Now, the sponsor, the person who invited you to join the business will do the heavy lifting. All you have to do 
is the easy part. That's invite. Invite, 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 invite. Invite to your head, can't think of nobody else. And invite them to come and see what you're doing. Don't talk a whole lot. Don't tell them a whole lot. All you want to do, invite them to the party. And then we're going to ask you a question right now. Can I hold you accountable? That I is the person who sponsored you. Can they hold you accountable? And there are only two answers, yes or no. They're both right. Whichever way you decide to say it, if you say no, we understand that. Then we don't have to worry about, you know, staying on you about certain things, you know, checking on you about certain things. That's completely up to you. You can go at your own pace. You can do your own thing. But if you say yes, then guess what? Accountability is the glue that ties commitment to results. And that's what this is all about. We want you to get results. Guess what? You paid some money. You paid $219 plus, you paid $998 plus, maybe you got a founders members pack, but you paid some money. And guess what? You should make your money back. You should get some results. Number three, protect your business. It is your business. So how do you protect your business, Dr. Ross? Get certified. Yes, we have education. We want you knowledgeable. And we have a certification that takes place the first Sunday and the Monday of every single month, unless that falls on a holiday. And if you, for some reason, your schedule doesn't allow you to make it live, guess what? It's recorded. So there is no excuse for you not to get certified. You get a certificate. You become what we call a Wakanapreneur. And it helps you keep your business and your marketing efforts compliant. Things change. We're in an industry, an ever-changing industry. That's a good thing because that means we're in the infancy of this industry. So all of the certifications that we go through help to keep you informed. Plus, we get new products. Dr. Rita keeps us up to date. Our compliance division with Dr. Joy keeps us on point. Melissa Boston keeps showing us different ways for us to get do our marketing. And Phyllis Nash makes sure she always teaches us regarding everything about the compensation plan. And so many others, as we bring on other people, Doris Mosley, she keeps us now compliant and everything regarding the whole hair division. Oh my God, it's everything is here to help you grow your business and your client base. And then not only do you attend that certification the first time, that's the one you paid for. You know, if you paid the, the 998 or the 219 or the, or the founder's pack, it came with it. Because normally, if you get it a la carte, it's $199. But if you got the full crown jewel, you got two, two of those vouchers to attend, one for you and one for a friend or family. But not only do you attend that one, but every month, there's another one. And you want to stay up to date. And guess what? The first one, you do have to take a test. That's how you get certified. That's how you get your certificate. That's how you are legally called a Wakandapreneur. But all the other ones after that, you can attend, no more tests, but you're getting that information and staying up to date all of the time. That's absolutely amazing. Number four, create your story. How do you create your story? You get products and use them. I don't know. I, I wouldn't buy from anybody that does not use their own products. Now, I am the first to use everybody else's testimony. And you can't hardly hear any of our presentations and not hear somebody talk about what CBD, what Wakana, what the flat belly lifestyle, what the, all the stuff that we have is doing for them. But guess what? You need to have your own story. You've got to have your own story because it needs to be authentic. I'm so glad that we don't have paid actors. You see some of these commercials on TV, they're promoting different things, and then you find out, mm, oh, okay, they got a piece of that company. Oh, they're paying them to do that. So you don't even know, do they really drive in that car? Do they really use Weight Watchers? See, it needs to be authentic because facts tell and stories sell. And you have a crowd of people. You have... A, 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 a number of people in your family and your friends that, that know you and they'll believe it if you say it, opposed to me just coming on there to somebody they don't know. So when you have used your own product and you say that it really works, guess what? That's real. Number five, make a list. Now, this might be one of the hardest things to do. 
Because every time we make that list, what's that list? That list is your phone. So first, don't tell me you don't have a list. Because if you don't have a list, go ahead and just give me your phone contacts and let me call them and put them under me. Everybody's got a list because you've got some folk in this phone, whether you've talked to them last week, last year, or years away from now, but you have a list. You also have a list on Facebook. You got Facebook friends who, if you're like me, everybody's your friend. Some people, you don't, you don't befriend them unless you know them. Whatever the case is, you've got a list. You've got people that send you emails inviting you to be a part of their stuff. Come on, flip the script. So you got a list. Now, here, here's where the problem lies. We prejudge that list. We say, oh no, that's Uncle So-and-so. He, he ain't gonna even be interested. Or this one, some of you are in the NFL list. No friends or family left because you've done a few things in your lifetime and they see you coming. So you're not trying to call them and talk to them. But let me tell you something. You don't know who's in your list that you're prejudging that's not sleeping good at night. You don't know who's in your list who maybe has high blood pressure and never told you about it or who is dealing with stress. Come on now. How many people now are not dealing with some level of stress because of the pandemic, because of the gun violence? All the stuff that's going on to raise up our level of stress and our products help. So what did I say? Don't prejudge. I need you to hear me on your shoulder when you're going through your list and you start saying, oh, they're not going to be interested. How do you know? Until they tell you, until they tell you they're not going to be interested, do not say they're not going to be interested. Don't, don't read their story. Don't, don't, don't develop their story for them. Let them tell you that. Because here's the thing you don't want to happen. And I've seen this happen over and over again. Somebody will come a month from now or a year from now and tell you they were dealing with something and they started using some CBD and they didn't buy it from you. And the only reason they didn't buy it from you is because you didn't tell them that they had it. I've had people on my list that I told the first time, the day one, when I sent out the mass email, when I sent out the mass information that I was in business, that did not respond or responded negatively. And a year later, they came back saying, you still doing that stuff? You still got that CBD? So make your list. Number six, contact and invite. C-H-A-T. This is something you learn in our certification. Melissa teaches us that it means choose, hello, add, and tag. Choose, hello, add, and tag. We have a Wakana Facebook page. In the, on the Facebook page, there's a way to contact people every day, anytime you want to, and let them know to come and see our Facebook page. Now, that does not mean they join Wakana. You want to engage them to be a part of the Facebook page. Whether that's Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, whatever social media. Hello guys, social media is what we're using in this hour, in this day that we live in. Back in the day, it might have been the telephone, but social media is here. So come on, stop telling me, I don't do Facebook, I don't do Instagram. Stop, 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 do it. It's not about walking out the door saying, hey, I'm going down the street. Hey, I'm going around the corner. Here I am in Hawaii. No, it's not about telling everybody your business. You're telling them about your business. Not your personal business, your business. And it doesn't just come off with just join my business. Nobody wants to hear that. Talk to them. Get on Facebook and say hello. You will be surprised at the people you will come in contact with. I've had people to reach out to me that knew me in elementary school. Well, how, Lord knows, I don't know how they recognized me, but they did. They said, your mama made good lunches. And she did. <laughs> so say hello, add them to the Wakanda for Life page, and then tag them. C-H-A-T. Okay, so let's, I'm going to stop for a quick minute and show you because during this, this training, we try to show you and be real specific and making sure you understand how to do, not just what to do. We want to make sure you know how to do it. So if there's anybody here that you've been having some trouble with Facebook, let's go to Facebook and let's show you how to do it. All right. Let me move that out the way. And okay, so here's Facebook. 
come on Facebook. Okay, so I'm gonna close that and I'm gonna open it up again because it's acting slow. Here we go. Okay, so when you open up Facebook, that's the first thing you see right there. You're going to your Facebook page. And if you're a person that doesn't have a Facebook page, I'm gonna just tell you, ask a niece or a nephew and in five minutes you'll have one. That's just how easy it is to start one up, right? So when you get it and you go to it, the first thing you see is what's called the feed. Some people say, okay, here's my page. Not really, this is not the front of your page. This is the feed. And this is where you see what's going on in the life of everybody else. So. I'm, I'm saying that because I don't want you to get caught up here because you can get caught up looking at what see these are some friends of mine in Dallas, Texas it's celebrating the anniversary and here's some other folk and um, here's something Crystal Robinson, uh, one of our distributors. Okay, and look at that. See, so you can really get caught up. Don't get caught up here. Your purpose now is to go to the face your the Wakana Facebook page. Now, if you've never been there. There's a little symbol up here with three people in it. That's what those are. And you put your cursor on there and it says groups. Click that. And then go over here to the left-hand side where it says search groups and type in there Wakana. And you should see Wakana for life. And this is if the first time you're doing it. Once you do this, it should be listed over here on the left-hand side and you don't have to keep doing that, especially if you visit often, which I hope that you will. And you see Wakana for life. How do you know it's the right one? Because it has over 13,000 members. So you click that. Now, when you click that, for a first time person, it's gonna say join. Your sponsor should invite you to join. Once you've joined the page, now it will already say that you're joined, past tense. Now, what do you wanna do? It said choose. That was the first thing. So that means we're going to invite people. We want to choose 10 people a day. Now, if your schedule doesn't allow you to do 10, do five. If you can't do five, do two. But do something, some kind of activity that's going to invite people to the group page. Now, those names will come up. Now, the person you invite has to already be your friend on Facebook. So when you go there and you see these names, it, you know, it pulls them up for you. Put a check in the box. Put a check in the box. However many you're going to do. I said 10 a day, right? Put a check in the box. Put a check in the box. Once you do however many you're going to do, click send invites. That's it. Facebook does the work. Facebook does all the rest of that for you. And now they're going to send them a notice, a notification, and they'll get, there's a little bell up here in the right-hand corner. That's notification. They'll get that saying you've been invited to take a look at this page. The rest is up to them. Now you can't make them join the page, but if they do, now they can become engaged in all of the activities on our page. So like for instance here, that's an announcement that I'm doing this deep dive training today. So now the next thing was add, we did that. The next thing is tag. How do you tag? So let's just say you came to our Facebook page, you are joined now and you have some, team members and you want to invite them to be a part of this particular training. So you're going to tag them. You're going to go to where it says you're going to find the announcement or the graphic or the video, whatever it is. And you're going to look for where it says write a comment and you're going to put their name again. They've got to be your friend. So now let's say if I just did my husband, when you start doing that, it populates those names related to that that are friends of yours. So here's the first one, Adrian Belt, that's my husband. But as you notice, I put a space and I can type it again. And there's some other Adrians, that's his son. So there's some other ones here that are friends of mine, but you can put as many as you want. And once you're done, just hit return on your, on your uh, laptop or your desktop or your tablet, whichever you're using. And it sends them a notification that there's a post that they want you to look at. Again, that's up to them. So anything, see, Michelle Stewart just put a post here. Napoleon Hill once said, say, so if I wanted somebody else to see that same post, what do I do? Put their name there, tag them. Here's the, the diamond factor, Phyllis Nash. 
Now, while I'm here, let me share something with you, because a lot of times people are looking for things on our Facebook page, and they say, Dr. Roz, where is so-and-so? I didn't see it. Or I want to see Shannon King where she was cooking. Or I want to see Dr. Rita's teaching on depression. Well, if you didn't catch it when it first hit the page, it may be way, way down, and you spend 15, 20 minutes looking for it. Here's a shortcut. You see this little search bar here, this little magnifying glass? What happens if you just click it? So let's say, what do I want to see? Uh, I want to see Dr. Rita just did a teaching recently on depression. So I'm going to try this. Now I'm just doing this. I'm going to try to type in depression and see, hit search and see what happens. It says I'm going to leave that page. So it's going to look for that. Wow, look at there. CBD for depression with Dr. Rita McGuire. All right, here's another one. CBD's effect on depression. That was done in 2021. Look at here. Angie Dickerson posted some things and depression is in that word right there. Here's another teaching, okay? So you, you get what I'm saying? So you don't have to spend all that time you're looking. Now say I want to look for something else. I'm going over here to the search bar and I'm gonna type, um, let me think, what do I wanna type? Let's say I'm gonna type millennial. Cause I know the millennials do things on Thursday and here it goes tonight at, this was in 2021, this was a millennial thing here. And this was Melissa Boston talking. So, I mean, it takes you all the way back to see different things based on that topic. Maybe if I did Tariq, cause I know he does it, it would give me more current things cause it has to be something related to whatever title we put on the post. So there's Tariq Rogers and if I click his name, then I see this was done on, this was just more recent, March the 6th, right? So that's an easy, a quicker way to find things. I just wanted to share that with you, a, a quicker way to find things. So now let's go back now and go to, so that was chat, C-H-A-T. Now, if you're not on Facebook, you can use a system, any system, but you definitely want to use Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, um, whatever, you want to use messaging, you want to use text messaging, you want to use making a phone call, all of that. Now, let me stop here just for a minute because I still want to show you how to do this on another way because a lot of you find yourself out and about, right? And you're using your phone. So let's go to the phone. Okay, something it didn't update. I need to update a new installer for the phone. Okay, so it's doing that. Here we go. Go on to the phone. All right, so just know that I am using, I am on an iPhone. Let me move this. But if you're on an Android, doesn't matter. You're still going to see the basic same things, okay? Because you got all these apps on your phone, whether it's an Android or an iPhone, you have to know where to find your Facebook app. So there it is. Now I'm on a phone, Facebook is there. Again, what's in this first area is what's called the feed, okay? So how do I find the top of the page like I was talking about? Here at the bottom, down here at the bottom, there's that same little icon for groups. I'm clicking that. And now I go to the search bar at the top right corner. Did y'all see that? Right here, there's that search bar, click it. And I'm typing the word Wakana. This is for first time people. You've never done it before, now you do that. And there's Wakana for life, this one here. Wakana for Life. Okay, so you've joined, you're a part of it. Now, once you do that, you'll see Wakana for Life when you go to groups. Same thing, here's the invite. The same button we talked about, invite, bam. Click that, and the same way you add people, just invite, just click each invite. Invite, 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 however many you're doing, and boom, it does the work for you. Once you've done that, click the X, and you're coming out of that. 
So let's, what we did, chat, C-H-A, and remember when you're chatting with people, you're talking to them. You have a conversation. It's not just about join my business. How are you? How's your family? All that kind of stuff, right? And now I'm scrolling, I'm scrolling, I'm finding something I want to share. Uh oh, here's something good. Here was a video. I just posted this an hour ago. Total Flex, that's our new uh, exercise program. It's right there. Who do you want to know about that? All right, so now I'm looking for some friends and I'm going to send it to my husband. That's him. And I must hit the space bar and I'm going to send it to who else? Um, let's see, who else can I find? I don't know who else I can find. I got to put a capital letter. That's what's wrong. Nobody's coming up. Surely I have some more friends. Okay, so there's one. All right, send it to her and put a space, and you can keep on and on and on. And then you're going to hit this little, the difference is you're hitting this little blue arrow. That's how you're sending it. Bam. Send, and it sent them a notification. And that's it. You're done. All right? Now you hope they will respond. Okay? So that's everything on the phone. Okay? So let's stop sharing there. And let's go back to our screen. C-H-A-T. All right, number seven, follow-up. The fortune, guys, is in the follow-up. Here I go. Stop judging people. Stop creating their story because a person didn't answer the telephone. Okay, you don't know what happened until you know what happened. Don't assume they're not interested until they tell you they're not interested. Why do I say that? Because life happens. Life happens to all of us. And, and, and Wakana is not a priority to anybody until it becomes a priority. It wasn't a priority to you until it became a priority to you. When did it become a priority? Probably when you used the product and it worked. Probably when you got the vision and you recognized this is, I'm, I'm on to something. It became a priority. So the fortune is in the follow-up. Don't get discouraged and disgusted just because you call somebody one time or two times and all of a sudden they didn't respond back. You don't know what happened. Let them tell you what happened. Something else may have come up. I mean, legally, I mean, something truly might have come up. But keep, stay at it. Stay focused on that. And that's not bugging a person. See, I have some people that send me things regarding what they're doing over and over and over and over and over again. And you know what happens sometimes? Have you ever seen a commercial that you see over and over again and finally you say, you know, I'm gonna try that. Yeah, see something triggers. And so sometimes you have to understand that that's part of marketing. That's part of getting things in front of people and recognize if you love people enough, if you care enough of people, you want them to know about CBD. You want them to know about a bioscan. You want them to know about the flat belly lifestyle. And you, I mean, to me, it's just like when I want somebody not to go to hell. I want them to know about Jesus. So whatever, whatever your belief system is, you want people to know about something that's good. This is good news. So the fortune is in the follow-up, okay? Number eight, plug into events. Now here's what Wakana's put in place to make things easy for everybody. We have events that you don't have to sell. You don't have to talk. You don't have to know anything. You don't have, really, you don't have to know anything. You have to know how to invite. We have the calls, we have the, the, the morning calls, the webinars, Monday through Friday, there's something going on. We got Facebook, we got YouTube. I just showed you the Facebook page. People join our Facebook page and they get engaged and see what's going on. And, and then Melissa will post something and congratulate people. And you see people getting accolades, you people taking trips. And all of a sudden, what is going on with this company? It, make, it intrigues their curiosity. Then we got YouTube videos. Fortunately, we're able to, to, to download the YouTube videos of all of the teachings, and especially with Dr. Rita stuff. Let me tell you something. If there's no other thing you need to be plugged into, it's Dr. Rita's YouTube playlist. I create that playlist, and it's available to everybody. Okay, so let me stop here. I want to show you. I don't want anybody not to know about the YouTube playlist. So how do you do it? Go to, go to my page, really. Okay, I've got a page. My name. Okay, let's go there. 
move the bar out the way. And if you've never been there before, just type my name. Let me see, I think you can type Dr. Roz. You can try that. Or maybe you have to type my full name. You say, yeah, Dr. Roz works. I don't usually go from this, this way, so I have to figure this part out. So you see there, there's the page. Now, if you've never been here, there's a way that you can subscribe. See, it says I have 951 subscribers. Dang, I hadn't seen that. <laughs> <laughs> That's fantastic. Okay, so what happens is if you go here and subscribe, click where it says playlist. Now, I know some of you just look at videos, but it's better to click playlist because then you can see the whole list of playlists that relate to that. See there, I, I created one recently, Wakana Dr. Eric Prince. Always look for anything Wakana related. Everything else is really not related to you because I have a lot of music stuff. Here's what, Wakana Total Flex, just made this playlist recently. And if you click here, you can click play all or view the full playlist. Now I'm, again, I'm on a laptop right now. So your phone is gonna look a little bit different and I'll show you that in a minute. But look what's here. You can play all of them. You can look at each one listed here. Here's the last one I just put here. And you can share these with people. That's what's important because how do you share them? If you want to share all four, you would just come over here to the left-hand side where this little curved arrow is and click share. Share it on Facebook, email, or just copy the link and then go to your email and paste it to somebody. Now, if you wanna share an individual video, you have to click that video. Hi, everyone. I don't wanna play it, so I'm gonna stop it. And underneath it, it says what? Share, bam, click share, copy it, paste it somewhere else, or send it straight to Facebook, send it straight to their email, or any other method that's here that you might have going on in your life. There you go, easy, right? So all this is right here on YouTube. Lot of stuff, lot of stuff, lot of stuff. Um, and the most important one that I think if I can find it, there it is, Wakana Dr. Rita. Reason I wanna show you this one, because sometimes people will come to you and say, does CBD help with erectile dysfunction? Oh, hold on, can I send you a video? Does CBD help with depression or thyroid or gastric reflux or endometriosis or heart disease? Okay, did you get the picture? How many are there here? Right now, there are currently 128 videos. You take the time, go through the list so you can know it helps with MS. All these things that you don't have to teach, Dr. Rita has done it for us. And I even have one now that Dr. Kim has put together when she does hers. Any of the doctors, if they do something, we try to put it on here and we try to give them their own playlist, but it's easy. Again, go here, click this one. I really wouldn't click that one to give to anybody because that's all 128. Mm, sorry, really don't nobody want that but you, <laughs> okay? But if there's one in particular, Parkinson's, and I think she just recently, the, the most recent ones are at the bottom. See, that was Parkinson's, and this is a recent one. She's done Parkinson's before, but she just did a recent one, CBD and Parkinson's by Dr. Rita. How do I, how do I show that to somebody? On your laptop, you click it, click that individual video, I'm showing you this again. Go underneath it and click share. Click copy. It copies it. You don't see anything happening, but it's copying it. It's holding it in the memory of the computer. So let's just say I want to copy this and I've got somebody, I'm going to send them an email. I, what did I do? I just jumped to my email. I got a Gmail account. You might have a Yahoo, a Hotmail, a whomever. And let's say I'm going to send this out. And I'm going to tell them in, in the subject that this is, uh, what was it about? About Parkinson's. Whatever you're going to say in the subject line, tell them, what, tell them something. And then write something. You know, don't just send them a video. I thought this would be a blessing for you to see. And then what happens is you hit paste. 
You can right click and hit paste. You can use your keyboard and hit hold the control key and hit V. Control V is paste. I know you think control P, no, that's print. But these are just shortcuts that I like people to learn to do that you can get better at what you're doing on your computer. Or you can just right click like I did and hit paste. Either way, the video's there. Now I'm sending it to them. Boom, send. Guess what I just did? I sent that to myself about Parkinson's by email. Okay, if I was back on this page and I did share and I hit Facebook, then it would go straight to my Facebook page and I would post this particular video on my Facebook page. Boom, there it is. All right, so let's go here again and let me go back to the phone because I know you guys are using your phone. So I'm understanding that more. Let's, I did the plug-in already. What are y'all talking about? Come on. All right, here we go. Okay, let me stop and let me go straight there. All right, we're on Facebook. I mean, we're on the phone again. Because a lot of times you may be out and about somewhere, right? And you are sitting next to a person at the tire store, you're getting your tires changed, and then you see them in pain and say, hey, can I send you a video? What am I gonna do? Let me move the bar out the way. What am I gonna do? I'm gonna go to my YouTube app on my phone. And hopefully you've already subscribed to me. So you got me real there, got my YouTube page close to you. But whatever you do is you go and find that YouTube video. So again, bypass all this stuff you see, go to anything that says Wakana in front of it. So here we go, Wakana, Wakana. Well, some of it is music. <laughs> But what if you want to share something about what kind of flat belly lifestyle? Bam, there it is. Okay, and there's several videos here on your phone. If you hit this top arrow here, it would share all of them, right? But if I didn't want to share them all because you know you don't want to overwhelm a person, but I just want to share this first video about Dr. Prince and he explains the bio scan. Well, these three little dots, you press those, and now it says what? Share. I click share, and now I have ways of sharing it. I can copy the link itself, or I can send it right to their message. That's text messages. Or I can send it to their email, or their Gmail, or their Twitter. All of these are ways to be able to send it to that person. All right. Good enough. I think you've got it. I hope you've got it. If you didn't get it, definitely let me know. Let's go finish this out. So we got all these events and we these ways to plug in. And then every morning we have these calls. Monday morning is so important because it's our CEO who gives us all of our updates every Monday morning about the company and that gives accolades to people and what they're accomplishing. Tuesday through Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, Tuesday through Friday, so motivational, so inspirational, helps you get your day started, only takes 15 minutes. And if you miss it, guess where it is? It's on our Facebook page, the Wakanda Facebook page, it's recorded, it gets posted there. Then every night, these calls, these Zoom calls, are to introduce Wakanda, the products, who we are, our flavor, to your, your potential, customers or clients or business partners. Monday night's a corporate party, Tuesday night's a doctor's edition, really designed for all the healthcare professionals, whether they're nurses or LVNs, RNs, or particular doctor in their field. They hear the doctor language, right? Wednesday, why Wakana? Dr. Rita teaches a different topic every Wednesday night. Thursday, the millennial spotlight. 
that age group can see themselves in operation. Tariq and his wife do a phenomenal job. And listen, you don't want to miss that, even if you're not a millennial like me. I just get on there anyway. I mean, I get that recording and I'm always listening to it. And then Saturday, Minister Mooney and I, we try to help people cross the finish line because sometimes people are what? Sick of Zooms Monday through Friday on their jobs or whatever, or maybe they're just spent, period. And you can get them up on a Saturday morning and we can help they take place. And then every now and then we have what's called hashtag the Wakana difference. And that's where our VP of compliance, Dr. Joy, as well as our chief medical officer, Dr. Rita, keep us in check regarding compliance, what to say, what not to say, how to properly do everything, because there's a, a, a right way to do everything. And then we have conferences, four conferences per year. 420 Freedom, it's Health, Wealth, Legacy, and Freedom. We just recently had our wealth conference where we turned three years old. So get ready for the next conference. Don't miss a conference. That's all I'm saying. I have nothing else to say about that. Just don't miss it because they are fantastic. They're phenomenal. Um, right now, we've been doing them virtually. So that costs less than having to fly a ticket to go wherever we're going to be. Hopefully soon we'll be able to do that with what well, we are planning on doing that for Vegas for one of our conferences. So just get ready and make sure you're a part of all of this because you can invite a person to a conference and they will more than likely join the business because they see the bigness. Okay, that's how I describe it of who we are. All right, number nine. This may be the most important part of your business because if you don't know how to enroll a customer and you don't know how to enroll a business partner, your doors are not open. That's just it, because you have an online dispensary, remember? So understanding that you have an online dispensary, you need to be able to know how to enroll a customer, or at least how to tell a customer how to enroll. So how do you do that? All right, let's go to the website. Here we go. All right, so now I'm fixing to go to the Wakana page. You have two, you have two websites. A Wakanda for Life and a Wakanda page. But the Wakanda for Life is kind of more designed for your customers, but they can use either page you want to. But when they go there, they have to sign up. They can't sign in because they don't have a, a page yet. They don't have a, an account, a customer account. We're talking about customers. So they click sign in. And when they click sign in, here it says at the bottom in a goal, create a customer account. That's what they have to do, or that's what you have to do for them. Either way, because you will have some people that don't uh, do website, they don't do online, so you'll have to do one for them. I have a lot of customers, they don't do internet or anything, so I create an account for them, right? And they give me their credit card information when they're ready to purchase something, or they cash app me or give me cash, and then I go online and put that order in so that you still get credit for every single customer. So what do they do? Their name, their email address, very simple, same kind of stuff you do when you go to um, Amazon or any other e-commerce website. Their address, where they're gonna do it, where they, their physical address, the billing address, if it's different, shipping address, if that's different. And they put a check mark here for the terms and conditions. If they're one of those persons that likes to read everything, read it, click it, it opens up. Oh no, you know, everything's transparent. But that's all the fine print. So you can read all of that and find out what our terms and conditions are all about. And then click complete registration. Now, even if you have a potential customer, it's okay to create their account. Even if they're not buying right now, because when they get ready to buy, then they'll just sign in and put their email address and their password because you've created the account. But if they do it then, then they can just shop. That's it. The rest of that is, is done. So now you just shop like you do on any e-commerce site. Now, when a person decides that they want to become a business partner, they click the gold key. Bam, gold key is right there. Now they choose which package they want. Do they want the full crown jewel, 998, the millennial, the stimulus? the 50% down crown jewel, or the free 30-day test drive. So now let's just say they wanted the crown jewel. What do they do? Add it to the cart. 
Now you click complete enrollment or free test drive. Now they fill out this information. We need their email address. What the replicated distributor website, they, we want to know what do they want their website to be. Mine is drroz.wakanda.com. So this is where they type it. No spaces. If it's something that somebody else has, that's what it's going to say. Not available. So I would have to add something else to this if I wanted to use that same thing. But remember, again, no spaces. You don't have to type the Wakanda part. Wakanda does that for you. Then a password, confirm it, a secret question, because that's for security purposes. The answer to the question, if they're using their social, it's their personal tax ID and their social. If they're using a business EIN, change that to business tax ID and put an EIN. Don't mix them up. Don't put personal tax ID and then put an EIN. That won't work, okay? Then you put the first name and last name. Middle name doesn't even really show up. But here's what you sh should be concerned about. What do you want people to see when they come to your website? Your name? Or are you working incognito and you don't want them to know it's you? Then here's what you do. Whatever you put here at first name and last name, that's what's going to show up. If you don't want people to know it's you, then you're going to put uh, Belt Enterprises. And then last name is going to be LLC or whatever it's going to be. However you choose to split that up, doesn't matter. But that's what's going to show up at the top left-hand corner. Then a phone number and the date of birth. Ignore that tax exemption because we, you're not, you, <laughs> this is a for-profit. Uh, birth date, put that there. Then your e-wallet. Now here, this is so important. E-wallet, what is it? That's where you get paid. All of your commissions go to your e-wallet. It requires a four-digit PIN for you to get your money out to go to your checking account. So guess what? You can't call customer service and say, hello, I forgot my e-wallet. What is it? No, no, and no. This is your money. Only certain people can give you that information. So it's not accessible to just our regular customer service like everything else. So don't forget it. So what am I saying? Use something that you normally use. That's my suggestion. Like with your debit card, doesn't it have a four-digit pin? Right. Or write it down somewhere, put it somewhere where you'll find it. Don't write it down and can't find where you wrote, where you wrote it. <laughs> and then a security question, an answer, a secret question, which is for security, and an answer. Billing address, shipping address, all of that. And then there's some agreements. Now, these agreements have to be done every time somebody makes a purchase. So you want to familiarize yourself with them, you're, that's fine. Guess what? Click each and every one. We have a cancellation policy. We have a refund policy. I mean, we, we refund everything, okay? Terms and conditions, everything is clickable. It has, link, has a link to it, and you can read it all, or any person can read it if they want to read all of that fine print. Once you click all of that, our payment method. We have several ways that a person can purchase several cards american express discover mastercard and visa look at there and we also take cryptocurrency yes that's becoming more and more popular people might have some coins they want to use and they can use several different coins bitcoin ethereum litecoin see all of these fuel dash and we're constantly increasing in that area as well and then once they do it what C complete enrollment a little wheel starts turning in less than 60 seconds. Guess what happens? Their name will be at the top because now they have their own website. Bam. Oh, man, it's one of the greatest feelings in the world to see their own website there. And they are now your business partner. Right? So now let me go over a couple other things because sometimes you'll have a customer first and a business partner second. That happens quite often because people will use the products and see that it works. And then they'll say, can I become a business partner? Or can I have my own website? And that's what you wanna hear. You wanna hear that. So how do we do that? Well, let's go and sign in somebody who is a um, customer first. Let's see if I can find somebody. Nope, that wasn't right.
let's go. Yeah, this should work. And then you always got to put in your security, the capture for security purposes. Okay, so this is one of my customers. So how do you know it's your customer? Because your name is in the left as a distributor and their name is in the middle. That's how you know you've gone to the customer account. So let's just say Barbara wants to now become a distributor. Sign her in as a customer, go to her customer account and look for this big blue box, become a distributor. How easy is that? Bam, become a distributor. And now she chooses which package she wants, add it to the cart, just like I did earlier, complete enrollment. And now she creates, let me do that so you can definitely see what's gonna be different because she's already in our system. That's why you do this. You don't wanna start from scratch because our system already has some of her information because what? She was previously a customer. So the system already knows her email, her name, her, her shipping information. All we need to do now is determine what does she want her website to be and whatever boxes still have to be filled in and you're done. She's upgraded from being a customer to being a business partner. All right, let's sign her out. Let me clear the history because there's another example. What if you had someone who came in as a free website or they came in on the 50% down or they came in as a millennial or a stimulus and they want to upgrade. We want to hear that, right? So what do you do? They sign in because they're already a distributor. Even if they got the free website for 30 days, they've got a website. So now I just signed myself in. So now what do I do? I'm going to go and click this word shop. And then I'm going to go over here to the left hand side and click advanced search. And when I click advanced search, I've got some more categories. For the sake of time, I'm gonna click two of them. Sign up packages, which would be the one you would click if they had the free website and needed to now get a site. They would click sign up packages. If they already have a package like the Millennial the Stimulus, they're upgrading. If they did the 50% down, they're upgrading. So I'm gonna click search. And here we have it. Here's the millennial, the stimulus. Here's the 50% down first payment. Here's the crown jewel, full crown jewel, the personal use dispensary, the upgrade that's going from millennial or stimulus to the full crown jewel. They're only paying the difference. 50% down second payment. They did the first payment. Now they're paying the second. Um, and there's a MD physician pack and a website at reactivation. For those persons who maybe got the website and it's, it's gotten deactivated because they haven't used it in a whole year, they haven't used at least 360 CV in a year's time, because remember, we don't pay anything per month, so you gotta do something with it. Well, they can reactivate it for $29.95, and they're good to go. They pick it, add it to the cart, and do the same process we did earlier. All right, so let's go out of here. So that's, that's enrolling a business partner, that's enrolling a person that wants to become a customer. Now, let's stop for a second real quick. And again, let's go to our phone. Don't know why it's keeping, wants me to keep installing like I'm not installing. But anyway, it doesn't take long. And the reason I'm showing you this phone action because it looks different. Everything I'm showing you on your laptop, your desktop, or your tablet 
looks a little different when it comes to your phone. So now I'm going to whatever browser you use, whether you're using Safari or Google Chrome, whatever it is, doesn't matter. You want to go to that website, your website. And so now I'm wanting to um, do the customer. I just want to show you where it is. Everything else is going to be the same, but how to find it. This menu bar is important for you on your phone. Three bars, it says menu. That's where you find login. When I press login, now you see create customer account. I move the screen up till you could see it. Everything else will be the same. It's just up and down instead of left and right. Same thing now. Let's say I'm going to want to upgrade one of those customers. I'm putting in the CAPTCHA 491882. Okay, so now the gold key is right there for those that you want to start as a distributor or if you're going to upgrade somebody. Where do I find that shop that I was talking about? Click that same menu, three bra menu, and go here and click main menu. And now I see shop. See shop, you see all of your shop categories are there for you. Anytime you're looking for where to find all those categories, they're behind that menu. All I did was click the menu to come back to it. While I'm here, let me just show you, because when I get to talking about um, things in the compensation plan, regarding data viewer and all of that it's under this other menu right here that's where you find it all see their messaging earnings my team you'll see me talk about those in just a few minutes but while i'm here on the phone i just want to show you where they are and if i do shop now and you always have to wait on your little bar to go across so Y'all stop clicking, 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 pushing because you're impatient. You got to be patient. So here's my advanced search. And when I do the advanced search, I scroll up. There are all those categories, those same categories. There is my sign up packages and there is my upgrade options right there. And I'm pressing search right here. And now I scroll up and I see all the same things I showed you before, 50% down crown jewel, all of that's right there, right there. All right. All right, we're almost done. That was number nine and number 10, personal development. You can't make it without this guys. That's what the Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday really helps us with. These are just a few books that we suggest. Uh, these are books that have been uh, here for ages. If you're like me and you like Audible, I like to listen to stuff when I'm in the car. And things are on YouTube available. And the one that's not here that I definitely suggest, and that's the Bible. All right? So you want to continue to grow personally. And here's my bonus. Bill Britt, he was a successful distributor in Amway back in the day. This man was, he became a millionaire where other people were complaining about all the product they had in their garage. And anytime you see people succeed, you want to know what's the trick? What's the secret? How did you do it? Well, he said, there is no secret. I simply showed the plan to 1,200 people. 900 said no, only 300 signed up. Out of the 300, only 85 did anything at all. Out of the 85, only 35 were serious. Out of the 35, 11 made me a millionaire. He showed the plan to 1,200 people, 11 people out of the 1,200. A lot of us would have quit right there at the first 900 saying no. Well, we, no, forget that. We wouldn't even made 900. <laughs> he worked through the numbers. It's a numbers game. And you will hear us say this over and over and over again. And you have to tell yourself that when you get discouraged. You have to tell yourself that when you're ready to throw in the towel. Ask yourself, have you talked to 1,200 people? Or have somebody ask you, <laughs> remind you that the success of your business is the speed of your business. 
So keep the momentum, no matter what pace. Everybody here is not operating at the same pace. Some of you are full-time. Some of you are part-time. But you got to do it sometime. There has to be some activity. You, whether you're walking, jogging, running, sprinting, or flying, you just got to keep moving. So get ready. Pick your three dates. Let's have your grand openings. Let's have your parties, whether it's a scan party. Tell your friends and family, I just launched my new business. I need your support. Come, we're going to give away some stuff. We're going to have some fun. Even if it's somebody you think is a businessman or business-minded, they're sharp. You just want, what do you think about CBD? What do you think about, um, uh, have you ever heard of the bio scan? I mean, we got all kinds of things you can say to people to get them engaged in what we're doing. You just launched your own cannabis CBD business. We got videos to send to them, four videos now. Ask your sponsor, what are those four videos so I can send that to all of my prospects and get them engaged. And guess what? We're ready to rock and roll. Okay, I'm gonna stop sharing for a minute. Anybody got questions on this part of what we're doing? I think of some stuff in the chat. If somebody can look in there for me, because I can't do both. I can't look up here and look down there. <laughs> Just unmute yourself and let me know if there's a question in the chat that I need to answer somebody. Dr. Ross, somebody's asking how, unless you answered it already, how do you find the ID and passcode? Can you get that to Jennifer there? How do you find the ID and passcode for the virtual for the yes for the Zooms? Okay, so uh, your sponsor should be able to send you that whole list. It's a list. We call it. I call it a virtual schedule. And if they don't have it, let me put my email in the chat, and you send me an email, and I'll send it to you. Uh, where's the chat? Okay, chat is hidden. Okay, there it is. Here's my email address. I'm using, let's use this one. D-R-R-O-Z-D-E-L-T at gmail.com. I've been using this one lately, so did I do that right? Okay. If they don't have it, they should have it. If they don't have it, email me and I will make sure you get it. And then if they don't have it and you get it from me, you email it to them. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, Dr. Ross, let's see. Can you put up the four videos again for the invitation? That's from Theo. Okay, um, better yet, because you really can't, you, you need them to be linkable, so they're not linkable on there. So you really, hold on, I'll send them to you another way. I got them over here. That's do, 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 four, four videos. Oh, that's the wrong email address. So that's real good for there we go. Bam. I'm gonna send them to you this way. That way, when you copy and paste them, they'll be clickable. Because if you look at them on that paper, you can't do anything with them. So, chat. There they are. Now that's the way you want them, right there. Thanks, Doc. That's a great question. And that's a good way for me to start putting them out there like that, because that's that's current videos. Because we've had we've changed them a little bit, and we've got new videos. And that fourth one is the flat belly lifestyle. So, great questions, everybody. Anybody else have a question before I get into compensation? Thank you, Lisa. You're welcome.
All right, let's jump into this real quick. Let me close this. 